Well, it's foggy and rainy and not a good day for camping. So what do you do when it's camping? When it's foggy and rainy and it's not a great day for camping or hiking. So what do you do? I guess you find something inside, like a cave. So we're going into the Lost World Caverns. Follow me in. All right, we're going down into the cave. Ooh. This looks like a very deep cave.
seen a lot of these down here. First set with antlers though. Run free, my boys. Oh, there comes his girlfriend. Hello, folks. Our campsite, I believe, is in what they call the Greenbrier Valley. It's uh, part of the Greenbrier River. And that's what the, the Greenbrier Resort and uh, a whole bunch of other stuff is Greenbrier. We're raining. It's raining. But it's not so bad that the boys don't want to go hiking. Um, it's just that uh, the camera keeps fogging up because it gets wet. So we've got the camera under the umbrella and I'm going to take advantage of that too. But we are on the Greenbrier Trail and it is about, I think, around 60 miles of Old Rail Trail. Um, it's a beautiful trail. It's got some beautiful uh, railroad bridges over the river and uh, aqueducts and viaducts and all sorts of things like that. So it's a really nice trail. And since it's raining out today, there's not too many people on it. <laughs> so we're taking the dogs for a walk with no leash and hoping that it's uh, okay. There are campsites along this trail, and there are, and it's a trail that can be used for horses or bikes or hikers or whatever. Well, we started hiking this trail at mile 14, and now we're at mile 30. And just up ahead, there's supposed to be a tunnel. So we want to go through the tunnel and see the tunnel. And Aquila still is full of piss and vinegar. Hey, come here. But uh, he's been good. Hey, no. Get up here. One other thing about these rail trails is that they tend to go through a lot of um, property. <laughs> I mean, it's a railway that, you know, used to go past farms and fields and all sorts of things. So um, you do have the potential for a lot of, well, we made it. <laughs> After much walking, much driving, much looking, we made it to the tunnel. Here it is. It's a very big and dark tunnel. And it's wooden supports. It's a very scary tunnel. The little guy has no fear. He's going right in it. There are reflectors all through it. <laughs> Guess I should go take the, go get the, you can see the other end, way down there. It's dripping, but I don't think we're gonna keep going. Dakota doesn't have any interest in following it. But it's neat. This is such a neat trail. <laughs> we loved rails to trails. So we're gonna see if we can find one more thing. And no, we didn't really walk 15 miles to the, this tunnel. Um, you can get to it by road. Um, come on, get out of there. They're playing in the mud. Um, so 
there's a there's a viaduct bridge over a, the river. Let's see if we can get to that. We'll see you in a little while. If I get to, if we can get to that, we'll see you then. Actually, the real trick now is to see if we can get out of this mud hole. <laughs> the things I do for you guys. Come on, get out of there. Come on, in the car. Akila, come. Get in. Get in the car. Come on, Dakota. Get in. Come on, you can get in. Get in there. 